Uh, my name is Sophie Pipe and I'm leading the Seeding Change Together project collaboration between Cornwall Wildlife Trust and Sea Salt who are funding a three year trial. So within our planting season we try three different types of methods for restoration and we hope by the end of the three years that we'll have an effective method that we can begin to roll out and restore the dwarf eelgrass which is a type of seagrass that we have here in Cornwall and hopefully in the long term start to recover those historic beds that were once here. Hi, I'm Will. I'm the Head of Sustainability at Seasalt Cornwall. We're really proud to support the crucial work that Cornwall Wildlife Trust is doing. We're so excited at the progress of the project so far. Seagrass restoration is so important for the environment. In the last century, we've lost 92% of our native seagrasses. Not only is seagrass an incredible carbon store, but it's fantastic for supporting biodiversity. It's a habitat for a nursery ground, so for fish to raise their young as a feeding ground and also for shelter for rare and endangered species. That is instrumental to battling against climate change and also protecting and developing our marine ecosystems. We hope that the findings of this pioneering project are beneficial to other seagrass projects happening in and around the UK. We're really excited to see these new shoots coming through. We've even got some that are flowering. So this is a really positive sign as these new outplants must be healthy and strong enough to start putting energy into reproduction and we hope that they'll then start to independently seed and look after themselves in the years to come.